When describing the causes of human behavior, psychologists define two major sources which affect behavior, personality and situational factors. While previous work has modeled personality in crowd simulations, we propose an approach which also incorporates situational factors to create dynamic behaviors where agents respond to their environment. Our system supports several different types of stressors in the environment. When experiencing stress, agents display a change in their behavior. In this scenario, an agent cuts quickly and directly through a crowd of people. The agent's aggressive path is a result of the stress induced by a monster chasing him. Here we see two groups walking through the hallway in opposite directions. Initially, lanes emerge between the groups. After an alarm turns on, the efficient flow gives way to chaos and congestion among distressed agents. We can validate certain aspects of our model by comparing the result to those known from psychology. The yerkes Stodson Law describes a well-known phenomena that stress can be helpful to a point in boosting performance, but can decrease performance when the stress is too high. Here, agents who are too stressed cause congestion, slowing everyone down. Here we show a quantitative comparison of speeds while crossing a street. Given less and less time to cross the street, the simulated agents respond to this time pressure by speeding up. Their speeds are similar to those of real humans in a similar real-world situation. Our method scales well and can handle complex scenarios with thousands of agents and obstacles at interactive rates. In this simulation of a scramble crosswalk, 1,000 agents simultaneously try to cross the street in all directions. When the walk signal begins flashing, agents experience time pressure and speed up. When the light turns red, those still in the intersection reach their maximum stress and run at a top speed to clear the way for traffic. Here is a comparison to a similar simulation without stress. Agents fail to show a response to the changing traffic signals. In this scenario, agents evacuate an office environment due to a spreading fire. The fire creates an area of stress for all agents. Additionally, some agents, shown in red shirts, experience stress from overcrowding and have a higher level of stress than others. These registered agents push their way through the exit to clear away from the stressful crowds. Again, we show a comparison with and without stress. The stressed agents evacuate faster and more aggressively than agents simulated without stress.